Welcome to Masters with me, episode four, where we show you guys every single game until we get to Masters inside of Power League, tips and tricks along the way, and we're L1, so let's get into the first draft. All right, hopping into the first draft here on Layer Cake already, and the picks look pretty normal so far. They first picked Piper, and we went Gray and Carl. Now, Gray, it's one of those really weird brawlers inside a draft that you can draft like two aggro brawlers, and if they don't draft anything against it, you're just gonna win the game if you play it right. Like You need to be coordinated, but it can work pretty crazy with the TP plays. So we locked in Carl, one of our higher level aggro brawlers, and we're hoping to make it work. Uh, they go with a Leon, and so far I don't hate this draft. I don't love it yet. I don't like this Edgar pick. I just think Edgar right now is just not that good. You could go something else that's gonna be better, but we have to wait and see what their last pick is gonna be. All right, well, I guess we got Edgar. So two aggros, this could work out. We could definitely still win this game, but I don't know how Edgar works anymore. So let's get into it and let's see. Oh yeah, and because we show you guys every single game, this is gonna be our first game of the day. So we could be pretty rusty here, and that's usually what happens. Our first First game doesn't always go well. We usually lose it. So uh, we're going to try our best to actually win this. Okay, that was the real Leon. I thought it was the fake for a second. Seems like Gray is going to get a nice snag onto Piper. And we're just charging our Edgar super, which I don't actually hate. Leon does have super as well. Edgar's going to get one. Pop his shield. Leon could be invis. Yeah, that's what I was waiting for. I'm going to let Edgar go in and die because I just, there's nothing really I can do. I have super now, though. I'm ready to go. And uh, I'm going to try to make a play here onto one of them. I'm going to go for both of these guys. Look at this play from our team. The gray TP'd in as well. That worked out really well. I'm actually surprised at how well that worked out. Nice shots from gray gets one onto Leon. This is getting a little bit close though. Gray is pretty low. I'm going to try to get this Gus down pretty low as well. Edgar's going to go in. I'm going to go in now too. I'm going to get one here for sure. Maybe even two. I don't know. I don't think I can get this for sure. I'm going to try to juke some shots here. Oh, we do get that kill. I got to be careful of curves because Piper could curve me here, but we are up good right now. Four stars and the blue star to our name. We don't want to die to this Piper. Leon has invis. Gray's going to TP out. Edgar's going to jump in. I'm just scared of this Leon, honestly. I don't know where Leon is. I'm going to play safe. Leon has the super as well. The Gus super, that's kind of scary. Could be invis. Edgar's going to go down again. Now, if, if he goes down, we lose. This is not looking very good for us. Please be careful. He's one shot from Ghost as well. Edgar goes down another time. I mean, I could go in, but Gus has the ghost shot. Once you see that, uh, <clears throat> Gus has ghost shot, and there he goes. He uses it. We are still barely up right now. I'm going to try to destroy that. Now it's getting really risky. I'm not sure where to go anymore. I could make a play, and I might actually go for it. I'm going to make a play onto... Oh, how did I hit that wall? I got to be careful now. Edgar's going to do some random stuff. I don't know if Edgar's going to be okay here. I'm going to try to get a kill maybe onto Piper. No, oh my god, they lived on one HP, both of them, and we lose the game. All right, and that's the little rust that we get from the first game. I could have played more aggro. Somehow I hit that wall right there, which is really unfortunate, and I didn't get to the Leon. That was my target, and so that means we weren't going to get that kill, and uh, now Gray's playing very aggro. I don't know if I hate this or love... Can I please not hit that wall? There we go. I mean, he's going to go right here. We get one. We trade, and that's actually a positive trade, so, so we'll take that. We also have super... And, uh, I mean, we should have won that last game. That was really hard to lose. Uh, but it is what it is. And now we are going to try our best here. I don't know where this Leon is exactly. And that's what I'm going to try to be careful of. Does break it down with the gray gadget. Now, I could go in. But the thing is, I don't even know if I'll be able to kill them if they're all grouped up like that. Because Gus is going to get a ghost shot like he does right now. And now it's a little bit weird. I'm trying my best to kind of help my teammate. I'm going to just get out. Seems like Edgar's... Oh, they have knockback Piper. That's why Edgar's having so hard... Uh, so much troubles. I'm going to get a kill onto Leon, though, and just get out. Get us back the lead. And seems like Gus is hopefully going to have to use shield here. Doesn't even have to. There we go. That's the shield popped, at least. There goes our Edgar. And this is just not looking good for us. I'm the only one that's really able to get kills uh, easily, I guess. So I'm going to just walk up here, try to get that out. Try to get this super off onto the leon we get that i'm gonna be able to survive a little bit longer i'm gonna have to juke around this wall i could gadget out which i'm gonna do oh what has just happened the tp just actually messed me up they tp'd in and then i got stuck i don't know what's going on this tp is really not working out in my favor i got another kill though okay i'm gonna try to tp out there we go the tp worked that time i got a thousand hp back from it i'm the only one that can't die. Or actually, no, anybody can't die. I have five stars to my name. Edgar is dead. What is going on inside this game? I need my super really bad here. Ooh, oh, 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 this is just, this is just not it. Edgar is just not the play. Edgar goes down. I mean, Gray can maybe make a play. I don't know. We're going to lose this game. I had five stars to my name and we still lost really bad. 
Yeah, not ideal. Just don't pick. Just don't pick Edgar. Just don't do it. All right, hopping into next map on Gold Arm Gold, hoping to get that win back, get us back into Legendary, because we do not want to go backwards inside of this video. But either way, they lock in a Sam last pick, which I'm actually a little bit worried about. Sam is one of those brawlers that can really destroy us here. So this is going to be interesting. I'm going to focus the Brock and Bell. Hopefully our teammates can kind of hold back the Sam. And if we can, we're going to win. So let's hop into it. Now, after that first match of Knockout, our team kind of figured out how to play this matchup. And basically... The long range had to focus the Sam and I had to focus their long range. And that's kind of what we did. We ended up losing the first round again, though, in knockout. Similar story to last time. But the next two rounds, we were able to kill the Sam and then able to just clean up the rest of the kills. And that gave us our epic win, getting us back to legendary rank. And we had more games to go. All right, hopping into the next game on double swoosh now. I didn't get most of the draft this time. I was kind of sleeping on the spot here. But this is how the draft went out. We had an Otis first pick, which is not bad. Very safe. Then they went Gene and Surge. Now, Surge is kind of risky early but I still like the idea and at lower levels or lower elo you're gonna get surge levels pretty easily so I like that pick from them jeans just overall really good we went gray and penny and then they last pick brock which is actually really good into our comp so now I'm a little bit worried but let's hop into it and see if we can win all right here we go now I'm going to be mid or at least ideally I'm going to be mid but I could also play side ideally I think otis should be right and gray should be left but we're gonna go with this and I'm going to try to get some shots off onto that Gene. Also try to avoid giving Surge levels. And Otis is going to have probably a hard time versus the Brock. And you can see there comes the shots out. And there comes the level. Okay. I mean, I can't help that. He's going to get his levels. And now I'm in a bad spot. And I'm trying to not get pulled or get hit by a Gene at all. Try to also get my turret as soon as possible. Okay, we got my turret. But it's going to go down probably if I place it right there. So I got to be careful. Now Surge is level 3 what okay that's just not ideal and i have turret but oh my god this is just this is just not it surge level four now and i got spray from every which angle there's no way i almost killed surge which would have been huge but this is just awful like we lost this game right now i left i like the brock pick i'm gonna try to, the tp does not work they need one more i'm gonna place some barrels and just play aggro i'm gonna place the bear i don't know where gene is but i know this surge is just being super annoying I don't even know if Gray is playing or TP'd in or what's going on, but we are coming back, I guess. I gotta be careful of this. I gotta kill this Surge. I mean, it doesn't seem like anybody else is gonna do it. So I guess I'm going to be the one. And if Surge goes in our base, he does have one gem. So I'm gonna just gatekeep and hopefully our teammates can lock this down. I mean, I don't know what's going on. Seems like he's gonna TP out. I'm gonna play aggro now. Seems like Surge is still in our base, but I can probably get that kill. I'm going to place this turret back here. Pick up these gems. They need one more. <gasps> oh my God. Help. Help. This TP is just ridiculous. I don't know what's going on. They need one more gem, guys. Come on. Play aggro. The surge is on the left. Low levels, though. Only level two. No, that's not. Or level three. Never mind. I don't know how it got level three, but we're going to place the barrel. Oh, no. I'm going to be the one to die here. There's nothing I can do. We're going to lose this. This was so chaotic. Oh, wait a second. Someone got a kill. I know Gray died, but maybe we can reset. I don't know. Not quite, but we're going to keep playing. I think Otis is probably going to die here by himself. Yeah, there's no way that Otis gets that by himself. I'm trying my best. We get one, maybe. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. No, never mind. If you actually killed the Gene there and picked up the middle gem... That's nine, I think. I, I don't know. And well, guys, I think I described it pretty well inside the draft. I think I said how Surge is going to get levels versus lower level people or lower level elo. It's just like, honestly, if you're versus the Surge, play slow. You don't have to win that lane. You don't have to kill him. You don't have to do anything. If Surge gets zero levels, it is going to be really hard for him to play the game. And well, he actually did a good job by going mid there. And that kind of unfortunate. I was assuming he was right lane. And now we lost our gems, but I'm closer to turret. So that's the only good news going on right now is that I'm close to turret and Brock is still shooting, raining down mid. I'm going to try to get my turret as fast as possible. I need one more shot. Seems like Otis is doing much better job versus this surge. And now Gene could have pull. Oh, that's so unfortunate. Can I get this kill onto? I could TP. He does whiff the pull. Okay, maybe they can get a kill onto surge. There goes my turret. I don't know where this gene is, and this is really, really tough, guys. I'm trying my best here, but I'm in a pretty tough spot versus everybody shooting mid. Seems like our gray is going to TP mid. Does get a kill. Can I block this? I need help, though. Okay, he does get a shot off onto that guy. I don't know. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. 
I didn't even mean to TP. Mute him. Mute him. How did you miss the mute? How did you miss the mute? How? How do you miss the point blank mute onto the surge? How does that even happen? I don't even think we can come back in time now. This is ridiculous. How does that even happen? That was right in front of you. He must have auto aimed it. I don't know. If we're ever going to be able to do anything. I could just kill this surge maybe. Okay, we got the surge. You can pick those up. Definitely pick those up and get out. I'll help tank if I need to. It doesn't look like we're going to have to. We can definitely come back in this game. Please? Okay, we got one. Gray's going in. Gray gets one. I don't think Gray can get out, though. You gotta stop just going in for no reason. I'm gonna try to hold this position now. Oh, I missed some shots, though. Crucial shots. Can we get that shot? Oh, no. He's one shot. No. No, okay. Does have mute, though. Gray's so low. How is Gray so low? He sh shoots the mute. I don't know if he hits it. We just need the next gem. Pick it up. There we go. Tied. Oh, it's gonna be up to me. Oh, it's just, it's just over. I can't... Wait a minute. I can't do anything. <gasps> Great TP in. They can, they can reset. Oh, just gotta get the kill. Oh, just gotta get the kill. Oh my God, what just happened? All right, hopping into the next one on open zone. That last game was honestly really heartbreaking. I'm not sure really how that went so wrong. It felt like we had a shot. I will say we had a very tough matchup as the Penny. The Brock was good against us. There was always a level four, four surge breathing down our neck and Gene pull. Pretty hard game to play. I'm surprised we got it so close. And now we're hopping into this draft, which I do not like whatsoever. As you can see, they kind of have the ultimate range comp. And now I don't really know what to pick into it. Again, it's open zone. It is range. But if we just go range battle, they have Mandy and stuff. I mean, I could go Bell and I, we could just absolutely range battle this. And that's what we might do just because we're pretty confident in range. But at the end of the day, I do think Max is probably the better pick just because it makes them hard to hit. And in that way, we get a little bit more time inside the zone. But ultimately, this is going to be absolute range battle. Who's the better range team? We'll find out. Now, the reason I don't like range battle here is because the fact that they do have a Mandy. Literally the longest range brawler and the best range brawler and just open scenarios like this, but if the Mandy's gonna... Oh, okay, wait a second. Wait a second. I was not expecting that for some reason, but we're getting time. So that's the good news. We're getting time. I did go down, but Piper trades a kill with the B. Also, I'm not sure why Piper's running ambush. Bo gets a kill, which you love to see. Bo's actually up good right now. I'm gonna place another mine here, and uh, unfortunately, Bo goes down, and there's going to be a bell here somewhere. Okay, we're getting time, but we're also gonna all die here, so this is getting a little bit riskier than I like. I need some help to get this down. Do hit the Mandy that's also just going to pinch me from a mile away. And that's quite unfortunate. I do get the B though. So we're back in this game. That kill was huge. And maybe Piper can get a kill onto this, uh, I don't know, Mandy. I keep forgetting the brawler's name. But I don't know why Piper breaks that if you have ambush. It's okay though. Can we get a kill onto Lola? One more shot. Bo hit the shot. Here comes the, here comes the super. I know it's coming. Okay, can we get this kill? Please, focus Mandy before we get absolutely supered from downtown. There we go, nice shot from Piper. Can we get this B down? Everybody shooting that B, there we go. Here comes a super from Mandy somewhere. I know it's coming, there it is. We do judge it, but uh, it's getting a little bit close now. Can I mark somebody? We're gonna get the kill. Oh, does, does tank it. We get one onto uh, the Lola. This is a absolute fiesta right now. Like, I mean, Piper's jumping in. If Piper has uh, the other star power, this could go even better. Seems like B's gonna trigger that though. Oh my God, what an absolute fiesta. I'm just gonna walk up and help my bow. We're gonna get a shot onto, oh, you, you kind of messed up there. You should not drop your clone. And uh, Piper gets a shot. Piper's hitting though. Can we get a couple shots there? Okay, Piper needs to just stay alive. Keep getting time. I love this play by Piper. If you have to jump... Oh, beautiful shot from Piper. Absolutely well played. And uh, now we're just going to have to play aggro. Look at this. One more shot onto Lola. Okay, never mind. But we'll get that win. So we win the range battle. And honestly, Mandy is just not as good as people think it is good but not as good now with that first map win on hot zone i was pretty comfortable that we were going to win the next one with a long range just matchup if it's a skill matchup we're pretty comfortable and the piper was playing very well on our team and honestly it showed in the next game we were able to basically win even better than the first and we were just getting kills after kills shots after shots and we won the long range battle giving us another epic win inside the video all right, here we go, hopping into my least favorite map inside of Power League and inside of Brawl Stars, really. 
personally, I really dislike Canal Grande just because I think once you lose control, it is over. It's almost over, at least when I say that, because usually you can't get out of spawn traps and people don't know how to do it right. And if you're not coordinated, it's just never going to happen. Now, this is how the draft is playing out. I would have picked Grom, but they did ban it. So they locked in a Gene first pick. And with that, it was an easy decision for me. I wanted Penny because, well, Penny is good here, plus the barrel, plus the turret. I mean, I love it so far. And now we go with a Poco. Poco Sam, they're absolutely going to just go tanks against us and they're going to switch that easily. They're not going to go level one Sam. Now here, I don't hate the Rosa. You know what? I'm surprised. I don't hate the Rosa. Primo's not bad either. We got a Poco and Primo. We should actually win that 2v2. I don't know, but they're going to switch things around. There's no way this is a level one Sam. There we go. Oh, they all got level one Sam. Oh, this could be interesting. If everybody has level one Sam, who's playing the Sam? Okay, there we go. Level nine Jackie. Oh my God. They are just switching left, right, and center. But either way, this is it. Let's get into it. All right, here we go. We should all stack one lane. I really do think we have the better 3v3 potential at the start as long as we're not against the jackie against the wall but oh my god oh look at this look at the shots coming out poco just beats this by the way like honestly we are going to win this game and if we lose well you heard it not here first i really do think we should win this i mean i don't think they should be able to do much versus us oh that i shouldn't have been there though okay primo goes in i primo needs to play with poco I, this is still close still close i'm gonna drop the turret here Primo goes down. I'm not sure where they are, but it seems like we're going to play a little bit of everybody for themselves. And that's just not how our comp works. But, okay, can I get some assistance? It looks like I am going to get some assistance from the Primo and we should be able to get a kill. It seems like Poco's going to go down though, actually. We're getting some shots off, some splashes. I do have my turret and we're in a really good spot. Honestly, I know we're losing, but the name of the game is Control. And we just need one kill. They have supers, but like... I don't really know. As long as we don't get gene pulled, we should be fine. Joystick, hello. Primo, just jump. Primo, 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 primo. Please jump them. Please jump. There was a one-shot player. Why would you go for the full HP, Sam? Now, I'm in a bad spot, though. I'm going to try to run. I'm running for my life here because I don't want to be the one to die and lose the game for us. 35 seconds, though. I have a feeling one of my teammates is going to get pulled, and now it's going to get risky. Just jump. Oh, I got pulled. I got pulled. Okay. It doesn't matter, though. I don't know why Gene went for me. Gene should have went for the Poco or something. I have another turret ready to go. Poco's playing aggressive. I kind of like it. I'm going to drop this one. Kind of a waste of a turret. Oh, man. Oh, man. Poco died? I don't even know why Poco went over there. Come on. Wait a second. We're going to lose this game. I just... I, got, I can't understand the logic. I mean, I didn't play amazing. But I don't understand the logic of why you would go over there and even try to win that 1v1 and lose it. Enough excuses. I'm going to play better and we are going to win this game. I mean, that was just questionable decision. But at the end of the day, we still lost the game and I can play better. So I'm trying to get my turret right off the bat. That's exactly what I want to do. I'm hitting some shots. They are going pretty low. There is a kill and we're winning. Now, this is good. All I need is for nobody to die and let me get my turret. And then I'm chilling. That's that's all I want. I gotta be careful of Jackie Super though. That's, that's actually pretty scary. I got caught off guard a couple times and my joystick got stuck. And now it's getting a little bit risky. Can I one shot him? No. Poco does not heal me in time. It's okay. They should be able to still win this though. Primo beats them in the 1v1 and the 2v2. Especially since we have a Poco. And I like the way they're playing aggro here. I'm gonna play safe though because Jackie is in my face. They have a heal. I'm coming over. Okay, this is getting a little bit risky. Nice jump from the Primo, and now we chase this guy down. Absolutely well played to the team. They can chase if they want, but honestly, I'm just going to play up into this Gene, into this Sam, and it seems like Jackie went the other side, which is even better for us. I'm going to pop a turret here soon. Okay, never mind. No need. And it seems like Gene is probably going to get close to pull here any second. Oh. Oh, boy. That was kind of risky. We have another turret ready to go. Seems like Primo's going to get the jump off. I love that. And look, they get the heals off. There's no way. We can also gatekeep this quite hard. Oh, we didn't gatekeep the super hard enough, and they get away. Definitely could have got that kill. I mean, I can... If you go for me, I'd be interested in that. I don't really know why you would go for me. I'm going to drop the turret. Oh, boy. I'm going to drop my barrel. Just try to get some splashes off. Try to... Hit, just... Okay. I mean, if Primo survives, it is what it is. It is what it is. Poco is going to give Gene the super, and this is going to make it even closer. Why would you go and do that? Like, that just makes no sense to me. 
Jump this Jackie. There we go. We get the kill onto Jackie. If you're in the last couple seconds, please don't just suicide. It's actually the worst thing you can do. We, one, gave super to them, and two, you just gave them free stars. Like, just... I don't know. Don't do it. Now for round three on Canal Grande. Like I said earlier, we should win this matchup 100%. There's no questions that we have the better comp with the Poco and the Primo versus their two tanks. And well, round three was the best example of that. We absolutely just swamped them. There's no point of showing you guys a swamp. It was really just too easy. But the, I don't know how we lost the first game and the second game was a little bit close at the end. But either way, we won the third game like we should have no matter what. And that meant we were going to get another win and we had one more game left to go inside the video. All right, hopping into the last map and it's going to be pinhole punt and this is how the draft has played out so far uh it looks like we locked in bow first pick they go uh max and janet then we go spike so now i'm a little bit worried i kind of want to go m's here they want me to go carl i would be a little bit worried if i go carl that they go some sort of aggro but if they really okay there he also suggested m's and that's what i was thinking originally so i'm gonna lock it in and hopefully make this work out a little bit better i just wanted to make sure that we couldn't go a tank and carl is good against us but it's not the end of the world so i'm actually okay with this i probably would take their draft though if i had to but it's definitely winnable so let's get into it <clears throat> all right here we go and now we want to control the mid as fast as possible if we're gonna go at oh boy okay never mind they're not gonna let us do that i like that gadget play by carl actually puts us in a pretty tricky spot between the two of them they could pinch us pretty hard if they wanted to and that's what's going to happen you can see that max is really focusing us and now i'm kind of forced in a bad spot here uh is max gonna go for that i'm gonna get the ball out of there because max could definitely do some dash plays and it is now left up to me so i'm gonna try my best to hold this position while my teammates respawn Seems like Max has speed as well. That really shouldn't have hit me, unfortunately. And now I'm in a really bad spot. So it seems like our teammates are, are going to get the ball out. So, oh, hopefully he can get a kill there. There's one, but they're going to score here. Unless I get enough time to bounce them back. But it ain't looking like it. So, good gadget play from Carl. This time I'm going to expect it. And I'm going to go over here. And try to play a little bit more aggro onto this Carl. Because, again, I can knock him back. Uh, but I'm worried that our teammates are going to lose this. And it seems like we actually get a kill so I'm going to try to walk up and I'm going to pop my super and get a kill, get a double kill. And I'm going to grab this ball and maybe score this. And I think I can. Oh my God. My gadget just didn't go off fast enough. That was literally a goal. A hundred percent. You just shoot the ball and you gadget. And now I'm dead to this. Bo gets one though. They're both low. Spike actually can make this play. I think Spike gets this. Spike died. Spike could have played that a little bit slower. Does Bo get it? It doesn't seem like it. So we have one minute left to score. I do have speed gear, which is nice. Bo got to stay alive, though. And I'm going to pop super. Try to do some damage here. I don't have the heal star power, by the way. If you were wondering, I'm trying to get this a lot of damage out as fast as I can. Okay. Very low. Spike can maybe make this work. No. Spike's... Oh, my God. They're just not... not none of those shots are hitting. And now Spike suicided. That's actually worse than... I don't know. Everybody's suiciding now. Bo's got to stay alive. We're going to make a play together or else we're not going to get this win. I'm going to walk up to this wall. Try my best here. I'm going to bounce this Carl. Get this kill probably. There we go. I get one, but I don't know where my teammates are at. I got to stay alive up here. Make sure I don't go down. And I know I'm in between them right now, but that's what I got to do. I'm going to try to bounce here. Oh, I got one though. That's quite unfortunate. I traded one, I guess. They can maybe make a play. Oh, that's just a terrible pass into the corner. They get a kill onto Janet. They probably could have scored or at least tried to score as Janet was in the air. We got 10 seconds though. There is a little bit of time, but there's everybody goes down. So that's going to be it. All right, quite unfortunate. And uh, their comp is just so much easier to play. I'm going to go back here though, because I know that Carl likes to do this stuff. And I'm going to try to get some damage off. I do go down to the pinch though. Yeah, they just have a better... Oh, wait a second. He gets that out, actually. Well, not really. They just pass it out. I don't have my gadget up. I guess I got to stay alive a little bit longer. It's pretty tough, honestly. Uh, but uh, I don't know. They're just pinching better than we are. Look at this. I mean, I'm getting pinched from the sides. I'm now stuck here. I'm going to try to bounce him away. I have super, but I don't have the heal one. So I'm just going to wait a second. And now I'm going to super try to get this Janet. Janet's going to fly out, though. Probably get me down there, too. I almost killed Carl. Spike is just not even shooting at the moment. There's the super, but, I mean, that's... Oh, that's just game over. Yeah. Not ideal. All right, guys, that's going to be it for the video. Honestly, not the best one. We didn't play great, and we did not get ELO like we wanted to. So we're not going to move very far into the ELO, but that means more games for you guys to watch. So I hope you guys still enjoyed, learn from our losses. And if you did, like, subscribe, and I hope to see you in the next one. Peace.